Hello all. So I thought I'd do a quick video on how you can test the battery on a Toyota Corolla. And this is a 2012 Toyota Corolla, but it's not going to matter. It'll work on any Toyota Corolla. The method is still the same. And and all you're going to need is a is a multimeter. And it doesn't need to be anything expensive. It, it could be any low-cost $10, $20 cheap multimeter. It just needs to be able to read DC voltage is all. So right now i got to set on DC voltage. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to measure the battery voltage with the engine off. And so with the engine off right now, I'm, I'm measuring 12.95 volts. And so this is just measuring the battery voltage. And once we start it up, that voltage should go up. And the Corolla alternator should put out like at least 13 and a half to 14 and a half volts, with most of them putting out right around like 14 to 14 and a half volts. So I'm gonna go and start it up, and then I'm gonna measure the voltage. Okay, so I started it up, and it's running at 14.1516 volts, and that's good. That's roughly what we wanna see. We want to see at least 13 and a half volts. Well, 13 and a half volts is a little weak for a good alternator. You want to see it at around 14 to 14 and a half volts. That would be ideal on these Corollas. But if it's down low, if it's down in the 12 volts or anything like that, then it's not working. It's not putting any output out. So if you measure this with the engine running and you're still seeing like 12 volts, 12.90 volts, 12.60 volts, then you know the alternator is not putting out and something wrong there. If the voltage goes up like it is now, if it's right, right around 14 volts to 14 and a half volts, then it's good and that's normal. If it's over that, if it's 15 to 16 volts, then that's overcharging and there's something wrong also and that'll need to be checked out. But with the engine running, it should be right around 14 to 14 and a half volts. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a real quick video on how you could test the battery on a Toyota Corolla. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.